hi guys welcome back to our youtube channel so today's just is going to be on late aladea rumire well prince jide kosoko in remembrance of late aladea rumire went ahead to share a poster which says immortalizing prince muyidin agbola aladi arumire mr movie the first and ever genesis of home video to the fact that there haven't been so much publications and exposures back then compared to now where we have the life of social media a lot of people are not aware that this man late aladi arumire was the first man to pioneer a yoruba home video and on this bedrock lays the foundation of yoruba home video adding a caption to it prince jide kosoko said moedin alade or maru mire continue to rest in peace your contribution to the nigeria film industry can never never be forgotten the fact that several practitioners are enjoying your legacy today is enough prayer for you to continue resting in peace quote this was jide kosoko sharing this in remembrance of late Alade Arumire. Alade Arumire who died on Friday, 4th of July 2008, in an auto crash along Lagos Ibadan Expressway, was described by his colleague as a pace setter and silent achiever. The death of Alade, who produced the first Yoruba film on VHS, that is Kset, was, however, been described as a colossal loss to the movie industry and nigeria at large alade arumire lost his life in an automobile accident the late alade was said to have left his office for his yotomi golden estate in ofada village along lagos ibado expressway on his way back to lagos he drove himself in company of one baboyo a relation and two other unidentified men who alighted at berger bus stop he was said to have gone to resolve some crucial issues over land property but that while returning to lagos about 7 30 pm his pathfinder jeep was hit from the rear by a trailer which was on highway alade sustained severe injuries and when he could not immediately be rescued by baboyo the latter ran to his office to announce the incident afterwards alade was taken to ltv8 at Ikeda, but along the way he died and his body was deposited at shule hospital on allen avenue ikeja alade arumire was described by his colleagues with beautiful words and touching words as well even now that it's been almost 14 years after his death alade is still being remembered of his great work speaking of his death his first son bolaji spoke and shared how pain and how much of a dream it felt to him in an interview when he first lost his father balaji arumire said i thought i was having a bad dream when the news came to me i couldn't believe my father was dead because he aladi gave me an assignment in his studio he asked me to work on a recorded song with the promise that when he returned from his Yotomi Golden Estate at Magboro along Lagos Ibarra Expressway, he would come and take a look at the work. But when Baba Oyo, who was in the car with my father, broke the news, I was totally devastated and I find it difficult to believe. And for Prince Jide Kosoko, of course, a friend and colleague and also the then president of antp he said alade was a distinguished professional who was highly respected in the entertainment industry her association will give him a befitting burial it was in 2008 when late alade arumire had in an auto car accident as a strong pillar of the showbiz both locally and abroad the late alade was commended by other colleagues who trooped into his office to sympathize with his family the likes of inka kodri abilanri sule oye biaye adewale elesho remishitabe ola ibirunke and ade inka adewoye late alade rumire died on friday night at sule hospital ikeja as mentioned earlier arumire was said to be returning from the site of his new house along the expressway which he had planned to move into on july 15. Prior to the 1984 film lovers in Nigeria made do with cinema houses 
for their movie entertainment until Alade Aramira produced the first made in Nigeria home video titled Ekun. The production of Ekun on VHS format opened a new chapter in the evolution of home videos film industry in the country. According to him, when he was still alive, he said he borrowed 27,000 naira from his parents to produce that first movie. It was premiered at Super Cinema Lagos in December 1984. It's popularly known as Mr. Movie. Alade who had gone ahead to German, West Germany to be specific to study the language but during the duration of his course he realized that there was a crash program in film and television production specifically for foreign students and lectures were delivered in English. The course lasted three months. It was posted to Dutch Willy Television Village on the outskirts of Dortmund while at the place he made up his mind that if his host could run a television station based on their own dialect of dutch language he could do something similar when he got back to nigeria he returned and started yotomi tv and of course he also delved into real estate and named his estate yotomi golden estate well speaking of what it was like having to wear his father's shoe which of course comes with a lot of responsibility because his father was very versatile all area of entertainment helping it with real estate explaining this Balaji, the first son of late Aladi Arimere, said i was worried as a firstborn the responsibility was too heavy i thank god for good people his friend his main partner in the estate business mr oluremi olaliko miracle he took us under his protection, he became a father to us, he helped us, he's a good man. He made sure all my dad's other businesses too moved on with the estate. There are a lot of other people too, but most people were just after what they could immediately take away. But thank God for Mr. Miracle. End quotes. This was Bulaji Arumire in an interview with The Nation. Explaining where he was at the time of the incident, he said, I was at Yotomi TV when someone came to tell us that he just had an accident. I was shocked. Immediately, we ran to the place where we were told that he had been taken to one hospital along Alain Avenue, Ikeja, Lagos. So, on getting there, we were told he had died. He was coming into Lagos. It had happened at that point opposite Hotel Light Estates where the statue of three chiefs of Lagos are located. Left behind my six siblings and I. Two years after the passing of late Aladi Arumire. 2010, Aladi Arumire's first wife, Kudurat Amori Arumire, passed away. This is the mother of Balaji Arumire. She said that she had brief illness before her passing. Well, at that time when Aladi Arumire passed away, there were several other entertainers, both musicians and actors who passed away at that time as well. The incident death rate at that time in the industry called for so much alarm as some people considered it as something spiritual. Well, for the likes of Jide Kuzoko and Ogabilu, they considered it as something normal and natural as a lot of people also die. But because they are in the public eye, that is why a lot of people assume that it is quite spiritual. Well, another July 4th has come and it is in remembrance of late Arume Re Alade. We pray that his soul continue to rest in perfect peace. Well guys, there you have it. Do not forget to like, subscribe and drop a comment in the comment section below. Thank you. Bye.